Brothers in arms? Footage has emerged showing a Russian unit coming under attack from a Ukrainian ambush. As soon as they are attacked, the vehicle speeds off and the unit abandons one of their men to his fate. It is reported that the D-1 howitzer was seen in service with Russian military somewhere in the Hansk region. By the way, D-1 was put into production in 1943. Video from Ukrainian SSO of a captured Russian Yurigan MLRS-9 P-140 launcher in Kherson Oblast. Ukrainian air defense destroying Iranian drone. Yes, Krasava! Russia is modifying 800 T-62 tanks for the war in Ukraine. This means that all newer T-64, T-72 and T-80 tanks are over, and new ones cannot be produced quickly. Assess the situation of the tank factory in the video, by the way. This is hell. A Ukrainian refugee ends up in the middle of a pro-Russian crowd in downtown Prague by accident and by pure luck avoids being lynched. Pushed, spat on, and insulted, but escapes alive. Is it okay that genocide follows even within EU borders? Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe. Also, if you want to support Warthog Defense, please become our member and get early access to new videos, exclusive members only videos, and become administrator in comment section. The membership link is in the description. Rescues. Every day we had a guy last week at six rescues in six days. You know, he's doing the job every day.